They're all in line. And they're off. Half better than none is showing speed. Tickle me tick there. Kit Kat Caton moves up from the outside, and she's going quickest of them all. And will make the lead pretty easily as they come past the stands with one lap to go. So it is Kit Kat Caton and Elvis Trujillo clear by about two from Tickle Me Tick. Put that away is up on her outside third. Half better than none now tucks over to the rail to save ground around the turn. She's already about six lengths off the lead. Then Ruby Lipstick inside of Sweet Briar Academy. It's another six lengths back. We come to Tina's Legacy, and Royal Wow will have to pass them all. She is almost 20 lengths back of Kit Kat Caton, who sprinted the opening quarter in 22-1. and one. Wow, fast fractions on for Kit Kat Caton as she runs up the backstretch. She's got a clear lead of almost five. Tickle Me Tick is inching closer now from the second spot, then put that away. Half Better Than None is now off the rail, and she's starting to advance. There goes Half Better Than None in the red color. She's into third, now less than four lengths back after a half mile that was a solid 46-2. and two. Kit Kat Caton leads him to the far turn, but they're gaining now. Here comes Half Better Than None in Sweet Briar Academy, and Ruby Lipstick looks like she's got room down at the inside, but just checks sharply in behind horses. She was moving well, but just had to step on the brakes and lost a lot of ground there as Half Better Than None has gone by to get the lead. Half Better Than None off the turn. She's the clear leader. Kit Kat Caton dueling with Sweet Briar Academy second and third. Ruby Lipstick is now back fourth. Royal Wow from the back of the pack. But it's half better than none clear and driving past the 16th pole. Half better than none. And Manuel Cruz, super impressive this afternoon. Half better than none. Won it by four from Sweet Briar Academy, Kit Kat Caton, and Royal Wow.